Hey guys, look what's on my back porch. I've been wondering what's been, oh my gosh, eating the cat food that I put out for my kitty cats. I've got stray kitty cats I'm feeding on the back porch. And I know I have possums at night. I didn't know that I had a raccoon too. Now, the problem is, it's my understanding that raccoons are nocturnal. And if you see them during the day, this is my, this is what I heard years ago, that they were rabid, but oh my gosh, Oh my gosh, is he too cute? Look at the way he eats. Look at that. Look at that. He picks it up with his little paw and feeds himself. He's looking around. He's getting a drink. That is why, and I keep wondering, why is the water so dirty? I go out there and I change the water and I can't figure out why the water is so filthy. Shh. And this is why, is because he eats. He eats and then he... Shh. Drinks with food in his mouth and he's leaving the food in the water. So now he's eating like that. He's always looking at his surroundings, making sure it's safe. Oh my gosh, is he too cute? Huh. I had no idea I had a raccoon on my back porch. What's he going to do when I move in a few days? Oh. Yeah. I'll be moving in a few days and he won't have his food. Look how cute he is. Hmm. Well, he doesn't look like he's really skinny. I think he's going to eat that whole bowl of food. Hmm. Now he's going to... Huh. Just going to keep eating, I guess. Oh, look at his face. Oh, yeah, he didn't spot me here. I'm looking out the door window. Yeah, I thought maybe he was going to see me. Oh, there he is. Look at him. Look at him. Look at, look at that. I guess that's why they say he got raccoon eyes. Look at that. He's got a little mask on. Huh. Wow. Hmm. Pause the video until he's ready. Oh, I think he's cleaning his face now. Oh, no. Still eating. I won't pause. Oh, maybe because it's enough. Maybe I gotta put it back to normal. And then I can pause it. Nope. Won't let me pause the video. So, I don't know how long he's going to be here. I want the video to keep going. Oh, 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 look what he's doing. Look what he's doing in the water. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Look what he's doing in the water. He's, he's standing in the water. Look at him. What the heck? No wonder the water gets filthy. What is he doing? 
He's got his paws in the front. Oh, look at him. <laughs> that is why the water gets filthy. Oh, look at the way he's drinking. How bizarre. Oh, oh. <laughs> so this explains why the water is absolutely filthy. I have not been able to figure out why that water is just, I mean, it's just absolutely filthy. It's got food and it's just, it's like, wow, what are those cats doing to that water? Now I know. So he's reaching with the one hand and he's got his other paw in the water. How bizarre. Huh. I wonder why he does that. Does anybody know why he does that? I guess maybe it gets the food is too dry in his mouth, maybe. And so he's mixing it with water to make it moist. Oh, look, he's putting it right in the <laughs> Oh, my goodness, how silly. Oh my. Oh, look at him, look at him. <laughs> there he goes. Bye. Bye, friend. There you go. Thanks for watching. And uh, <laughs> thank you for watching. We are still doing our downsizing. Our house is, I mean, a mess. I can't even begin to, we got stuff everywhere. Look, this is our poor kitchen. Oh, it's just, yeah, everything's a mess. Look at this. We've got some stuff, Walmart's still up, but most of it's down. It's our Midsommar's Murders. We've got that on where we're cleaning. We're trying to get this room done tonight. But yeah, we're still in the process of downsizing. There's Corey. <laughs> Taking stuff out to the garage. There's a little Thomas. There's a Norman. We're all living in a state of chaos. It's just, ugh, it was the treadmill. Does that how most treadmills end up? It's just like that. It's not supposed to be there, of course, that's the kitchen. It was in here in the exercise room. This used to be the exercise room. There's my, uh, conversion table and look at that these are all the clothes I've got to get rid of look at that those are all costumes over there these are nice clothes over here I guess go to consignment look at all this stuff still got to go get through is this it's insane downsizing moving into an RV I gotta tell you you better have some stamina because it takes a lot of stamina well thank you for watching and uh Stay with us. Remember to subscribe, right, Thomas? Subscribe and like and continue to follow us. Right, Norman? That's Norman's milk bowl. He's always got to have milk. Right, Norman? Yes. It's Norman and Thomas. We're all going to be living in an RV within a few days. We're going from our big house. Yes, the washer's in the kitchen. Yes, we'll be going from our big house. Yes, a really nice size bedrooms. Look at this bedroom, it's humongous. With an ensuite, of course. Look, it's a mess, too. This is the way, if you're gonna be moving, you better be prepared, because this is how your house is gonna look. Another bathroom. Another room full of stuff. Oh my goodness, he's clearing this room out. Oh, I gotta stop him. I'm gonna have to stop the video. It's not supposed to be taking stuff out of here. This is the camper. Stuff for the camper is over there. And he's putting it out in the garage. So, I better let you go. Say goodbye, Thomas. Say goodbye. There you go. That's right. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Okay. Thomas and Norman and I say goodbye. Remember to subscribe and like and follow us. 
and see how we do with this mess. It's all going to be clean in a couple of days. I'll show you the video of a clean, empty house. Bye.